Welcome to Learning Arts and Crafts with Miss Janelle. I'm your teacher, Miss Janelle. Today, we will learn and create a self-portrait, Dare to be Different, inspired by Pablo Picasso. On the left is a selfie of me, and on the right is my Dare to be Different portrait. Materials needed for this activity, pencil, paper, black marker, and something to color with, such as crayons, markers, or color pencils. All right, let's say our mantra together. I am positive, I am creative, I am mindful, I am amazing, and I'm an artist. Our mantra is to remind ourselves that we got this. It also gives us confidence in ourselves and in our artwork. What is a self-portrait and who is Pablo Picasso? A self-portrait is when the artist creates a picture of his or herself. And this artist here below, his self-portraits, his name is Pablo Picasso. He's one of the most famous artists of the 20th century. He is famous for daring to create new ideas of art. Pablo Picasso had the courage to create different styles of art. As you can see, all his self-portraits are not the same, which makes his work very unique. So always dare to be different when you create art. So let's go ahead and get creative. Let's get started. We have our paper, our pencil, our black marker, and something to color with, and I chose crayons. All right, let's go ahead and grab our pencil. We are gonna go ahead and draw a U shape for our face. Make sure we draw pretty huge for our paper. We don't want a small U. We want a big U for our face. Now I'm gonna go back and outline it so you can see it much better. Awesome. All right, next we're gonna go ahead and draw the ears. You're gonna be very creative drawing our ears, just like Pablo Picasso. It does not have to be a realistic. You could have a rectangle ears, a triangle ears, it's up to you. Next, let's go ahead and draw the eyes. My eyes is going to be like a wavy rectangle, something different, making the picture very unique. Love it. All right, drawing the circles. Go ahead and draw the second eye. This one's going to be like a wavy oval. Here it goes. And drawing the circle inside. Awesome job. Next, you need to add our eyelashes. Let's add our eyelashes. You can draw as many eyelashes you want. It's up to you. Great job. Now, I have glasses, so I'm going to go ahead and draw my glasses. I'm going to go ahead and draw a wavy rectangle around my eyes. If you don't have glasses, it's okay. The next thing we are going to draw is our nose. Nose can be very tricky, but it's up to you how you want to draw your nose. You could draw it as a triangle. It's up to you. All right, adding some more details. There you go. Add in the circle for my nose. Awesome. Next, I'm gonna draw my mouth.
kind of drawing like a wavy line for the top part of my lip. And another curved line. Curved lines are very important to create these details for our face. I'm going to add a little smile, nice cheeks. Awesome. All right, next, we're going to go ahead and start drawing the neck. Nice lines going down, taking your time. Awesome. Now we're going to add our shirt. So we're drawing that curved line to make our shirt. Then we're going to do a diagonal line for our shoulders. That is part of our shirt. Awesome. Great job. Now this is the fun part. We get to create our hair. You can create it any way you want it. I'm gonna do my hair kind of crazy, but that's the cool thing. I'm gonna make it very unique. So I'm gonna go ahead and draw the hairline of my self-portrait. I'm using curvy lines for my self-portrait for my hairline. Now I'm gonna go ahead and draw some hair. I'm gonna start right there in the middle. Now I'm gonna do some zigzag lines. Going all the way, going all the way out. Awesome. Drawing all the way to my neck. Now on the other side of my face, I'm just draw some curvy lines going all the way down. Now, hmm, I'm probably gonna do, ooh, yes, curly. I'm gonna do some curly here. Now, you don't have to do what I'm doing. You could have a mohawk. You can have straight hair. It's up to you. I'm gonna go ahead and draw some more lines going down for my hair and there we go this looks amazing a pablo picasso inspiration dare to be different awesome job oh no i forgot to add the eyebrows so let's go back get our pencil i'm going to add the eyebrows awesome Now, we're gonna go ahead and get our black marker and we're going to outline. I have a Sharpie black marker. We're gonna outline our whole entire paper. Now, if the video is going too fast, you can pause the video or you can rewind. All right, take our time and outline. Our part. Awesome job, boys and girls. We are done outlining. This looks so amazing. Awesome job. Look at this. This is a beautiful, great. Now, the next thing we are going to do is color, but this time I am going to go ahead and fast for it my coloring you're going to see the end results this time and here it goes how amazing this looks so awesome what an awesome pablo picasso inspiration dare to be different we have different colors for our hair different hairstyles different eyes and that's what makes it so beautiful be daring to be different Boys and girls, make sure you write your name on your work. But awesome job today, boys and girls. I would love to see your work. See you soon.